Hey, yeah, blah, 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 blah. Today, I'm going to show you how to get the best two swords in The Witcher 3. The silver, the silver sword and the steel sword. I'm going to show you how to get it. So what you want to do is walk over to this destination and you will see this guy just dead over here and you want to pick up his loot. He's got some leather straps. Tickle me jingles. Leather straps are for bad boys like me. So I'm just going to pick this up and we will need this in the future, guys. Start to explore the greenery in the forest. Geralt needs to take a giant piss and this tree is way too thin to hide his big balls. Maybe this tree will work. No, it won't. This tree is gigantic. It's perfect for Geralt's giant gigantic balls. Now this is all for the two best swords in Witcher 3. Now the piss will uh, go travel underground of the grass and you will see uh, your piss inside a rock. Look at it, it's illuminating inside the rock. Everything's glowing. The piss is glowing. So you gotta capture the piss and whoop whoop. I have the ability to kick off a rock. And the way you know that you fully captured the piss soul inside your soul like the piss is if you look into Geralt's eyes, his beautiful yellow eyes, it's yellow just like your piss. So this is all part of the guide on getting the two swords in Witcher 3, the two best swords that is. Ha ha ha. Go find a sign and on the sign it says Clown Butt Island. So let's go to Clown Butt Island and we can finally get our hands on the two best weapons. And while you are on your merry way, you will encounter a peasant. He's just there surviving on berries and you're all like, boo, you scared bitch. You will then encounter a man on sitting on a, on a chair or something. And uh, remember those leather straps that we stole from that dead guy? Well, you got to sell it to this guy. Why do we have to do this? I don't know. You just do it for no reason. Try to hitch a ride with this guy. Hey, sir, I couldn't help but admire your horse's buttocks. I really do admire those horns on your head. Did your mother make that for you? Fuck you then, fuck you then, fuck you then, fuck you then. It took me nine hours to reach this place. If only that man had let me ride his horse. If only he let me ride his horse, I would have been here in five minutes or something. I'm just gonna commit suicide. <laughs> well, ship me nickels. Hey, penis boy. Where is our thou cows? That's right, folks. You'll need to find the cow and position yourself right in front of it. Stay here for about, oh, I don't know, 80 hours or so. And in the meantime, you can go out and play ice hockey in your alley. Once you're back from your little ice hockey game with your little pen pals, get outside over here and whistle. I mean, whisper. I mean, what? Whistle. You gotta whistle your way. And all of a sudden, something's gonna happen. Holy shit, did you see that guy's on the corner? It's our horse. It's a horse and we gotta get on top of our horse. That's right folks, get on top of this horse. And you will need to ride this horse all the way to your journey. Come on, we can do it. I know, tit face. Holy crap, what the hell? My game just crashed. That's right, your game will crash. This is all part of the process on getting the two best swords in Witcher 3. So uh, it, I know it's a black screen, but let me get back in game, guys. And the reason why your game crashed is because of this stupid, stupid cow. Okay, well, thanks, cow. You wasted like five minutes of my life. But you will need to slap this cow around, just a gentle slap on the butt. And you will want to make this cow fall in love with this other cow. And aw, look, they're in love. They're kissing. Aww, isn't that cute? Stupid cow. You go back to this guy and you tell him, Hey, yo, I just got your cows to like make love. Now you'll have more cows because they'll produce more babies. You'll have more milk and everything. Everything is going to be good. And he's not even impressed. I'm like, okay, how about now? You impressed now? Look at my parkour skills. Oh, oh, look, I'm jumping everywhere in front of your face. Oh, you like that? Oh, you just got up. Are you impressed now? Are you impressed? Talk to me now. And when he talks to you, he'll be like, oh, thankfully, thank God, you're so cool. You did parkour and you saved my life by having more cows in my life. Now, when you open up your inventory, you can see the steel sword and the silver sword. And it's awesome. So pat yourself on the back right now. <laughs> be sure to subscribe if you're new and leave a like on the video because leaving a like is pretty stupid. And why not subscribe? Because subscribing stupid. And I had to talk in such a low voice because everyone's like sleeping in my house. Everyone's sleeping. I have, to, I have to talk like this. I can't even like project my voice anymore. It's like, holy crap. This sucks balls.